And so Papoonin wisely ran away for dear life. Wise? Who wise now? You useless idiot! Why can't Papoonin not even die properly? What if they ask Bada to repay money? <laughs> huh? Die? Repay who? Meh, none of your business. Anyway, tell me where Rex and Blade went. Rex, Titan and friends ran away. Went to south of Cyclist Sea. After that, Banner knew as much as Papoonin. Storm was very thick, so Papoonin... Papoonin lose them, yes? Yes, but... And then, run away like coward? Yes, but... Ma, 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 ma! Banner not wanting feeble excuses of Papoonin! Just get back here! You got lot of work to do! Ma, ma, ma! Even pricey insurance banner takeout on Maelstrom go to waste! Still, how interesting. Heading southward from Cyclist Sea. In current season, that likely take them to Gormont. You go! Get Consul Dougal on the line immediately! Yes, sir. One moment, please. Why, if it isn't Chairman Banner! What an unexpected play! I just say that I admire how you rebranded those broken core crystals! And selling them onto the Dunderheads back in Morar Den. Absolutely sublime! Banner did not call to hear pointless flattery. And blubbering about core crystals on unsecured line? Is Dougal some kind of idiot? What if Indor tap our communication? Oh, of course. I'm very sorry. Meh. Forget it. We got bigger fishes to fry. Oh? What's going on? Listen up. Thank goodness. You aren't injured at all, are you? No, I'm fine. Where? I'm not certain. We seem to have washed up on a Titan of some kind. A Titan? <gasps> Where's Gramps? And Nia? Gotta find them. They can't be far. Okay. And now we've washed up on a mysterious place. Hey everyone, welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles 2. I'm Slayer Mathis, and last time we became a driver. And also we got annihilated by well a lot Treasure of things, acquired. honestly. We ran away. We we bravely ran away, uh, in the same vein as uh, Sir Robin, the not so not quite as brave as Sir Lancelot. Uh, yeah. So off screen, I believe it is just after you unlock power, you get the Rolling Smash Arc. I'm going for a sword bash with it, and if we look over to our left, we see that it is an ether attack. So it's you know based off of our ether makes sense I can't do anything with those but Pyra Pyra has her own stuff to have uh, I mentioned the weapons dealer we were exploring um, back when we were exploring Argentum this is what it's for you buy core chips from there you place them onto your blades they get better stats just like Rex My usefulness has increased Pyra has her own affinity chart we can see different things 
over here we have her uh, specials. Uh, so each special has its own thing that it does. So for example, Flame Nova, which I think is the level two, uh, increases damage up to beasts. Uh, Primus Revolt, which I believe is the no, that's the level one, two, and three. I believe it is. Uh, Promise Revolt increases damage dealt to toppled enemies, goes up to 150, and Blazing End increases your crit damage. These three are just your generic combat skills. Uh, these ones, they're just passively active, you know, that purifying flames. Uh, every special has a chance to defeat a non-boss foe with up to 20% health. It's not that useful, honestly, but it's something that's there. Uh, Resplendence increases your blade combo damage. This is actually very nice to have, and then Flaming Edge just straight up increases your crit damage. And these three are field skills. Um, we'll get into what these do in a little bit. She has uh, Fire Mastery, Focus, and Cooking, which is exclusive to Pyra. Yeah. Uh, we also picked up a red thread from that chest that increases your range that you get uh, from... Increases your range that you have the affinity line. Um, affinity, again, you do need to have affinity uh, with the blade active in order to um, in order to use your specials. So yeah, uh, just exploring around here, we have found the wreck marshland. Um, could also just say it's where we, you know, ended up getting shipwrecked. Um, if you consider Gramps a ship, that is. Which I, I mean, I, mean, I guess you kind of can. I mean, he's a bio ship, but a ship nonetheless. Yeah, so we got a bunch of new enemies here. Okay, um, bring it including this guy that I walked past uh, totally intentionally. Yeah. Eagle eye. Ha, why not? Yeah. It's okay. Thanks for that. So right there. Yeah. Um, yeah. We just got. You no, know, now we have pirate chill now. With us. Ha, um, blades. They'll just kind of chill out there. They'll usually have a little special animation while using their weapons. And we can show off Rolling Smash. My Rolling Smash, Smash is very nice because it increases your aggro. Anytime okay. you use special, you toss the weapon that. over to the blade. Why not? And yeah, they take care of business. Every day, taking care of business. Everywhere. I don't, I don't know the rest of that song, honestly. So yeah, just passing through the trees. Got another brog there. And it looks like we've... Oops. Grumps! It is good to see you uninjured, Rex. How awful. Hold on, I should have some herbs. You are kind. No amount of human medicine would suffice. But... Weep not, my boy. This is my fate. I... I can't help it. Can I? No parting is forever. We will surely meet again when the flow of the ether will set. <sighs> the days with you were the best I ever had. Until we meet again, Rex. Gramps. I told you not to cry, didn't I, Rex? <laughs> Rex. <laughs> Rex. Grams. Rex. Use your eyes. Don't you recognize me? Um, well, not really, no. 
I am so confused right now. So you see, maximizing cellular regeneration to retain all vital bodily functions, I seem to have reverted to a larval stage. Well, that's quite handy. Must be nice to be a titan. This isn't something just any old titan can do. Only one so advanced as myself. Um, Rex, are you angry? <laughs> I'm not. It's more that I didn't want you to see me blubbering like a baby. Oh, it's okay to be angry. So, when will you be back to your old self? Good question. No more than 300 years. Th 300 years? But I'll be long dead by then. Hmm. I suppose that's true. But what about my house? Do I have to live in the streets? Perhaps this is an opportunity to fly the nest. You mean... Pay rent? Oh, miser boots. It's a massive extra expense. Still, glad you're okay, Grant. Oh, shoot. We can't stand around all day. We have to find Mia. Mia? You mean that driver and her blade from before? Yeah. They kind of saved our lives. I do hope they're all right. Gramps, do you remember anything? I remember crashing through many trees before landing here. They probably fell off then. Hmm. That's not a whole lot to go on. Perhaps we would have some luck following the trail of broken trees. Good thinking, Pyra. Let's go. By the way, Rex, is that a core crystal I see shining on your chest? Just what happened to you? I'll tell you later. Right now, we need to find Nia. Oh, -ho! now this makes a nice change. And now we have Gramps tagging along. He does nothing. I mean, well, he comments, like, outside of battle, but... Or, yeah, but, like, he doesn't do anything for your stats. Right here is a collection point! Uh, collection points, there are points where you collect things. Come out, Shocking, come out! Um... Generally, um... I've actually forgotten what those are used for. Um, because I don't believe they are for the salvaging things. Um... It's probably just something that's later on in the game that they're used for, most likely. Um... I'm, I'm sort of trying to think through what they're used for. They are very important, however. I do know that much. Uh, this tree right here. If we press A on it. I call upon the power of fire! We call upon the power of fire and burn away this tree. That's a field skill. Of course, we went over that uh, a little bit ago. Yeah. So, that's what Fire Master does. Um, yeah, generally, level is up. You can pass through different obstacles. Um, you know, some obstacles are tougher to get through than others. Yeah. Come out, come out. We can boot these up. And get some things. More things and stuff. And items, even. Uh, yeah. Oh, I remember what, right. what the collection <laughs> things are for. Okay. All in one piece. And now, well, we've got another Marco here. What's that sound? I felt a ripple in the ether. It feels like a driver is using a blade in battle. I'm certain of it. Let's go. Okay. My lady, leave this to me. I'm not just gonna abandon you, Zuma. What? We're here to help. Mia! Rex! What are you doing here? My lady, now is our chance. Let's attack. All right, then. You fool, why did you put your weapon away for a second? That's dumb. But yeah, um... So I did I did call attention to uh, that you know, the little, little icon on the right earlier on. Uh, that's, that's what this is for. 
Uh, certain enemies are weak to certain things. You can activate what your party members are going to use for the light combo using ZR and ZL. Of course, you don't have enough party members that to do that with, but it's whatever. So yeah, right now, uh, you know, we got a healer and a glass cannon. So we're not exactly in the greatest situation for the fight. Uh, I was actually hoping to see if that one was actually... Uh, whatever. It's getting tough. Uh, yeah, so, Blade Combo, uh, you can have up to three levels of them. Um, you get those three levels, you get, you get the third level, and it gets real power. So why you guys even... Well, I guess that's a stupid question. Indeed. Seriously, it's good to see you. And you're alright. Right back at you. Hey, by the way... What happened to the big guy who saved us? The Titan? Are you talking about me? Wait, what? How? That's sort of a long story. Let's get somewhere we can rest. I'll tell you all about it then. That seems prudent, my lady. Sure, lead the way. I see. So you two are off to Elysium. Listen, I never thanked you properly. For saving us, I mean. Dromark said that you carried us all the way here. We owe you our lives, Titan. No need to thank me. After all, you were the ones who saved Rex. Don't mention it. So, you titans can regenerate. Pretty handy. This isn't something just any old titan can... You can retire that line now. Excuse me. I'd like less of that attitude. If you had listened to me and declined that reckless job to begin with, we wouldn't be in this mess. Take a nap, you said. Like I was some kind of doddery old man. Okay, okay, I get it. I'm a terrible disappointment. Look how sorry I am. Can you not muster even a shred of sincere remorse? Sorry, but I can't. Hmm, what? If I hadn't taken the job, they'd have got their hands on Pyra. Rex. I couldn't let that happen. No way. They can never take her. Uh, hmm. Hello there. Still awake, I see. I can't seem to sleep. It's good to see you again, Azurda. Likewise. Though you've changed a lot since last we met, Pyra. I suppose I have. A lot's happened. Yes, it has. I wanted to thank you for saving my dear Rex. And I need to know what you told him. Is that what you really intend? Yes. It is my true desire. I see. Well, that's good enough. I have no reason to doubt you, Pyra. That said, I do have one other goal now. Jin and Malos. I cannot allow them to continue with their current course. The fate of an Aegis never changes. Right. And you're going to get Rex mixed up in this? <sighs> I'm not blaming you. No matter how hard you tried, 
that boy would find some way to get involved. I see half your core is missing. Seems you've taken on quite a burden. Zerda, I... Promise me you'll take care of Rex. I will. 